Dear viewers, how are you all? Well, once again I'm back here. I'm quite glad to be back every time. So, I'm here today to make something very interesting. We are going to make today the pizza base. You all can imagine, generally what we do when we make pizzas at home, we buy the base from outside. But at AMC, we want our AMC partners, customers to make the pizza base as well at home. During these challenging times, it's important that anything and everything, if we make it home, it's more safer. So, let's get started to make pizza base. So, as you see here, I've taken refined flour, which we also call as maida. I have active yeast, a pinch of uh, salt, and also uh, powdered sugar. So, let's add up water as we do normally. Water can be added consistently as you go. I'm also adding a bit of a butter. As you see here, I've used a 24 combi ball. Make it in the nice and center and leave it closed for just one hour. So viewers, it's already one hour. So let us see how our pizza base has been fermented. So would you like to see? Let's open it up. You can see how nicely it has fermented. Let's cut it to four pieces. Yeah, perfect. We take one of it. So it's ready. While uh, I'm going to roll it down, but before that, I'm also going to switch on my 24 cm roaster. And uh, let's wait for the roaster window to start up. Roaster window, you see, the pot is getting heated up. Let's make the rolls. This should be fine. Most important, do not forget to poke it. Well, my audit thumb is leaping already. Okay, let's switch off the audit thumb. Switch off the Navigino as well. I think make some space. Let's have some magic. I'm moving the pot on my lid. I'm going to take this piece of base. All you have to do is upside down and on the single line, switch on, and just for, set it up for two minutes. Two minutes, viewers, blue line, indicator, keep it, forget it. So, viewers, it's already beeping, which means it's time up. Let's just switch it off, and quickly open it. Let's be careful while opening it. You see, perfect base is ready for us. Let's move it up, keep it nice and safe. 
and the reverse. I would like to show you very quickly how the base has come up. You see, such a beautiful base has been baked. Yes. Now we know what to do with the base, right? It's a typical homemade pizza base. So let me quickly show you how we can make pizza sauce as well. It should be nice and healthy, but most importantly, tasty. So for that, I'm going to use a 24 cm hot pan. So while heating up, usually we wait for the pot to get fully heated up. But today, we're going to do something slightly differently. I'm going to, while it's getting heated up, adding butter. I've taken less than 50 grams of butter. I'm also take, I've also taken fresh garlic. Fresh garlic. And two medium size onion. Slightly toss it up so it gets soaked up very well. And let's close it up. And wait for my roaster window to come up. Close the window. I think you guys quite fast. So let me let use the heat to zero first. Switch it off with my audio thumb. Let us check how. Yeah, you see here. As you see here, viewers, a perfect pizza sauce is ready for pizza making. Let's switch it off and allow it to cool for a few minutes and then it's ready for us to use it as the pizza sauce on the pizzas. So viewers, I have the pizza base as we showed you and also the pizza sauce ready. So it's time for us make the pizza. So to make the pizza again using the average new and 24 cm roaster pot. Let me get started with um, heating up my pot as our tradition goes. Heat up. up to the roaster window. The roaster window is set. So while my pot gets heated up I've taken pizza base. So let me quickly put the pizza sauce which we just made I prefer to make pizza generally around uh, half veg and half non veg. So let's get started first with the onions. My pot is already calling. Yeah, let me switch off this one and take the audio thumb, switch it off, make it nice and even. As you see here, viewers, the half side is um, this side is wedge, this side is non wedge. Let's get 
started, viewers, let's go on an upside down cooking. Take the roaster. Be very gentle when you are placing the pizza. Be very gentle. Nice and easy. So, what you have to do, all you have to do is close it down. In a single line, we'll go up to four minutes. You see here, four minutes, blue line, blue light, and single line. Perfectly done. So, audio thumb is beeping. So, let us switch off the audio thumb and let's see how the pizza has been done. Just be careful, viewers, when you're opening it up because it will be nice and hot. Wow. You can see, viewers, you can see definitely uh, the cheese has you know, uh, oozed out very well and I can see evenly cooked. Just in case, just in case when you open it up and see that it is not 100% cooked the way you want it, because everybody has a different choice, the way you want it, you can always add extra minutes. One or two minutes, you all can always add it. Time for tasting, viewers. Let me take a small piece just to see if it's cooked evenly and perfectly. And trust me, it's very juicy, dear viewers. It's really juicy. Just taking a small piece. It's really hot. My mouth is already watering. So let me taste it. Mmm. So you should definitely try making pizza at home with the ABC products. Nothing can be better than this. Viewers, enjoy pizza making at home and do share your comments and feedbacks to us. We'll be more than happy to help you in case you need more information to make this. On this happy note, let me say thank you and see you very soon.